Honestly, these guys always impress me. Putting down 68 hot dogs, 69 hot dogs, they're really impressive. But what happens to their bodies is even more impressive. Their stomachs dilate or stretch six times the normal stomach size that a normal person can hold. The average person can hold one to two liters of food inside their stomach. These guys can go six to seven liters. That's incredible, very scary. If you're wondering why you're seeing fitter competitive eaters, that's because they realize that the less fat they have on their bodies, the more their stomach is able to dilate and expand, therefore they're able to take more food in. Also, they notice that if they stay in great shape, they'll be able to burn more calories and therefore consume more food during the competition. Let's talk about the elephant in the room, sodium. Each Nathan's hot dog in the eating contest contains 710 milligrams of this stuff. That puts a tremendous load when you're eating 68 hot dogs on your heart and kidneys. That can lead to stroke or even death. You'll notice that the competitors are dipping hot dog buns into water before eating them. The reason they do that is to make the hot dog buns more compressible and slide easier down into their stomachs. Another surprising fact that they may not even know is that taking in the water will help offset some of that sodium load they're taking in. If you're a competitive eater, I'm not sure if you should worry about your next bowel movement because frankly, I've never seen one after a competitive eating contest. But like all bowel movements, they're probably pretty gross, nothing exciting, nothing special to see.